Hey guys, welcome to Macintosh Weekly. And today in this video, I'm gonna show how to re-index Spotlight on Mac. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. And now let's begin. Spotlight is macOS's built-in search tool designed to quickly locate files, applications, emails, and other data on your Mac by indexing content across your drives. Over time, the Spotlight Index may become corrupted, outdated, or incomplete due to system updates, file changes, or software conflicts, which can lead to inaccurate or missing search results. Reindexing Spotlight rebuilds this index, ensuring it accurately reflects the current state of your files and enhances search performance. To reindex Spotlight on a Mac, open System Settings, and then navigate to Spotlight Settings. In the Spotlight Settings, ensure that these items are checked in the search results. You can disable any of these as well, as per your preference. Now, scroll to the Search Results section, or Privacy tab. Click the Privacy tab if visible, or look for a section related to Spotlight or Search Privacy. Now you'll need to add your drives to the Privacy list. Click the plus button to add disks. Select your Macintosh HD or the drive you want to re-index, and click Choose. This prevents Spotlight from indexing the drive temporarily. Click Done once you add the drive to the privacy list. Now to trigger re-indexing, select the drive you just added in the privacy list and click the minus button to remove it. Spotlight will begin re-indexing the drive. A progress bar may appear in the Spotlight search menu and it may take some time depending on the drive size and its content types. This is the official method for re-indexing the Spotlight search on a Mac. However, many users may find that Spotlight on their Mac still does not work properly. Such users will need to force re-index via terminal. To do so, open the terminal from Launchpad or the Applications folder. In the terminal, execute each command one by one. Enter password when required. After executing the commands, quit terminal, and now, Spotlight will begin re-indexing the drive. A progress bar may appear in the Spotlight menu bar icon, and it may take some time, depending on the drive size. Once complete, Spotlight should work correctly with updated search results. Also, it's good to wait until the re-indexing is complete, as re-indexing consumes high CPU. If you still encounter any error, reboot your system, and then try Spotlight search again. So that was it. Hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any question, just comment down below. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.